Hello my fellow gamers, Simple Geek Gaming, and welcome back once again to another episode of our Ultra Hardcore Survival Island. And what has been going on since the last episode? Well, not much basically, but if you haven't been watching, um, I'll just give you a quick little rundown. As you can see right in front of us, look at all this food. We've got tons and tons of wheat, and we got some potatoes, which when a zombie was attacking me during when I was recording the last episode, he dropped one, so... At least we've got another option for food, so that's an awesome bonus. I'm just kind of annoyed because I really wish he dropped a carrot. That means we could uh, we could be breeding these two Mr. Piggies. One on this side and one on the other side. And this thing here is just like your basic freaking Enderman killer. You stand underneath it, you see an Enderman, you look at it, and hopefully it'll come towards you and you kill it. So you can get a freaking Ender Pearl and there's a freaking spider coming after me. Um... I'm going to have to freaking run down here because I do not want him attacking me. Come here so I can get some more string or get a spider eye from you. Come on. What were we waiting for, mister? No! Oh! Holy crap, I only lost half a heart on that. My god, I was panicking then. <laughs> oh my god. I lost freaking one out of elf one before I started recording one. I was freaking just... Kinda of didn't get out of the way of a creeper soon enough. At least there's another bonus. Um, we got a bed as well, so we can actually sleep through the night. And that here, I have absolutely no idea what the hell is that. It's either a glitch or something like that. I don't know, but look at that enchanting table. Oh yes, yeah. But for that, we kind we kind of need um, books and loads of them. And that brings us on to what we got in plan for today. For that matter, we got to grow all this sugarcane so we can try and get absolute bucket loads of paper. Uh, we've got to head to the other island which we found in the last episode to um, then make it safe for the fact that once it is safe, we can go through the never portal and make a new never portal on the other side and then... We won't be, won't we be worried about being attacked by freaking spiders and zombies and creepers and all freaking sorts of nasties. The only problem is, like, um, how can I put it bluntly? When we went through it on, we made the portal on that side and went through it, we kind of came through this portal. Or well, the portal that came, that's, um, I gotta say, spawned when we made this portal. So I'm gonna have to link a second portal so we can freaking salty oh that's a bloody pain and the other fun factor is i got to take a nice long freaking tunnel from there to um freaking it's north 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 west south yeah it's this direction i've got to dig a tunnel up in north direction and the coordinates i can't bloody remember i'm gonna to have to look at the freaking screenshot i made for it oh that's gonna be fun right first things first um get a few supplies ready and we'll head to the island and then make sure it's then get it safe then we can try and at least start with the breeding of the cows. Well, it's slowly getting there. As you can see, tons of freaking torches around here. And it is quite a freaking huge island. Though one thing I noticed when I was coming up here, especially if you saw it in the last episode where I went past the um, underwater temple, there's freaking two of them nearby. Never thought I'd actually see two freaking temples right next to this second island. Uh, I reckon one fun factor for me is going to be finding chickens. But one one thing that I forgot when I was actually coming up here was fences. Because I need to block all this area off. And my main concern as well is all these freaking caves as well. That is going to be one really big freaking problem. And there's my shovel. Right. I need to get that down without freaking dying. <laughs> At least when we go through that portal, I'll end up right back on the other island, which is going to be a good thing. And the bad thing is I'm going to have to take yet another boat up here. It is going to be pretty fun. At least on the bonus, like I said, cows. So I'm going to have, to f going to have some fun trying to breed those little baggers up. I need to freaking fence them all off and go through there. Yeah, one of these sheep can walk through here. Um when I set this up and the freaking I couldn't stop him. I couldn't to be honest I couldn't really be bothered stopping him. Yeah I don't know I don't even know what I'm talking about sometimes. Yay back on the original iron. Right I need tons of fences and how much wood I have excluding all that wood there which I'm still waiting to grow. How much wood have I still got in these two chests? And let me see one two three yeah that's gonna be more than enough. Right I'm probably going to need about 
four stacks and then head back up there, set it all up and then try and build like a little structure up there as well, like a little farmhouse or something. Well, that was a little bit harder than I was actually anticipated. Not for the fact, as you can see, just placing down, you're thinking, placing down fences for a thing. Oh, dead easy. Um, creepers. All I'm going to say, in creepers, I hate the buggers. Just the fact, putting some fences down that area. Next thing you know, one creeper comes up. I see it starts to flash, so I immediately try and freaking run away. And next thing you know, boom, I've lost another half a heart of health. Which, in my eyes, is freaking just ridiculous ridiculous though um at least we've got this area sorted so we can try and start sort something out first thing we've got to do apart from try and get down to the balloon bottom because i freaking put myself up here just so how can i put it bluntly to get some of these crops grown because we need to get some of these cow these cows and some of these sheep into pens so we can actually start to breed them for food and like I've said before these cows we need to breed them for the freaking leather and we're going to need an absolute metric ton of the stuff I was going to swear then but I just held, I had to just held myself back <laughs> oh God, I, wonder, I just wondered how long it's going to take just to grow up all them no um there's some skeleton math. I'm going to have a look around the outside. See if there is any bones that we can use on bone eel. Oh, why have I just done that? I don't know. Right, bones, 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 bones. Got to be some around here somewhere. And jump. Yeah, annoyingly, some of these freaking sheep escaped when I was building. I, obviously, I don't have any wheat with me. I didn't take any with me. So, <laughs> yeah, um, there should be some down here. Should be some bones. Please, 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 please. And... No. Ah, great. Just what I was freaking hoping for then. Didn't go my, didn't go the way I planned and now something's going to shoot me in the back. I just know it. <laughs> yeah, I hate freaking all sorts of freaking mobs. And... Right, throw it there, there. Okay. Now what? Oh, why did I do that? I don't know. I don't... Bloody no! Nice. Right. Now, one of the other things that I was going to say is I was going to build like a little mini house. Very, very simply, just like four walls <laughs> and a doorway. <laughs> I don't know why I'm telling you this because I've already said it before. Just I want this freaking wheat to grow. Why was I looking over there when the wheat's here? Ah, uh, right. Um, where are we going to put it? Yeah. Um. I've just had to put these there because another sheep had to escape through the portal, so yeah, pretty fun. Right, um, I'm going to put these fences down and then hopefully by which time this will have grown so we can get these cows in and then we can head back to them. We've got the fun task of freaking tunnelling through the nether. That I ain't looking forward to because all the lava and stuff. And you, Mr. Cow, are mine, though I've still got to get a good few of it, come on, come follow me, follow me, follow the food and into your upcoming death, or soon to be death, because I've still got freaking one other cow and of god knows how many more sheep to freaking, I need, don't even get in there, yeah, I hate the bloody, uh, freaking these mobs on this game, they're freaking stupid as you wouldn't believe, right, one in, now, how many more have we got to go, tons! And you can't escape. Ah, there we go. Freaking all of our sheep that we got. I think there are a few more sheep on somewhere, but I just can't be asked finding it. And we've had this little friend um, graciously just decide to join us. Little does he know, how could I put it bluntly, all of his friends are going to die soon when I do find the time to actually build um, a humongous freaking gold farm somewhere out in the ocean. God only knows where the hell is and I think I might as well just breed the first two cows. You sheep are staying put. Right. One. No. One and... So, oh yeah, I've turned bloody particles off, haven't I? So I've got no idea if they bred them. Woohoo! Repopulation, yay! Right, um, yeah, shall I kill him? I've got a bow, but I'm scared of, like, if he might go through the nether and alert all his pigmen friends, so I think he's going to stay put or something like that. Right, <laughs> yeah, that's going to be pretty fun anyway. Okay, now the fun part, head to the nether. So, we can build this freaking portal on the other side. It's just bloody annoying. We it's a case that both the overworld portals have decided to, how can I put it bluntly, link up to this one here. So, 
that is going to make it fun for us but it shouldn't be too much longer because we have all of this stone that's just for pickaxes and stuff and more importantly this obsidian so we can actually start digging towards um the location of where we're going to go and luckily enough i've broken down the ones of the other portal and then obviously dividing down by eight so that gives us the official corners we are heading to and um it's not too far off really 60 it should be 67 is it that way okay that's pretty close 67 57 Oh, it's up that way. Ah, right. Let's just dig. I right, right, get the first pickaxe out, and let's just head up this way. Hopefully, we won't get in, run into any sort of lava pools, because that'd be exceedingly bad. Especially the fact we not water doesn't work up here, and we haven't got a bucket of water regardless. So, 72. Okay, I dug to a little bit far. 67. Now, which way is it we're going? Is it going this? Way? 67. It's this way, yeah. Okay. Just make sure I'm lined up. So did do. And Okay. Right, this is probably going to take a while. I've got, I've got to go maybe only about 100 blocks, but I'll see you when we get there. If I spot anything special on the way, I'll be back. Oh, my God. Dab was a little bit too close for comfort. Right, it's almost got there, bloody up. Right, I need to freaking try and clear this out safely as bloody possible. Come on, come on, come on. Get that one gone. Now, let's just clear that out. Hopefully, that'll do the job. And there won't be any more bloody lava. Go, go, go. Come on, go. Yes, go. And... Yep, just that odd pocket of freaking lava, and we're literally right there. 57. Okay, we've gone past it. So, where is it? Um, Aha, uh -huh, right here. Cool. Right, let me just clear this area out so I can put the portal in. Now to see if this thing actually works. I'm never actually 100% confident with these things, especially uh, spawning where I actually want them to, but... I'm sure we'll find out in a second, so let's just put these last few blocks, and I seem to have freaking put one down in the wrong bloody spot. That always happens, and I really do want a freaking enchantment on this damn pickaxe, like an efficiency 3 or 4. No, 5 would be best, now because breeze for all this never act, and I'll cut through there. Ugh. Awesome, right, let's place that down, and make sure that's in the wrong right spot. Okay. Okay. Lighting that. Now, three, two, I'm nervous. One, in we go. Okay, I am really nervous. No, please, 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 please. Yes! We can go to and fro. Awesome stuff. Oh, there's an enderman. Ooh, shall we? Shall we? Shall we? Oh, yes, yes, yes. I want to try and get an enderman. <laughs> really do. Right, one. Let's just do this quickly. I really would love my first time to put. Oh, I've got a friend with me. <laughs> oh, that is really annoying, that, to be honest. Right, um. And then I'm just trying to work it out. Just to make sure I don't get freaking splattered by anything. And get rid of that. Uh, one, two, three, so we can come up to me and look at him. He's angry. Ha, I love that. Go on, drop in the pearl. Please, please, please get it up. First one on camera. Please, please. Are oh, you son of a. I don't believe that. Second enderman I've killed. And again, no ender pearl. Ah. Yeah, it's going to take me for absolutely ever to get all these ender pills I'm going to require just to, you know, go to the end, which is probably going to be long, long way off. Still got tons and tons of stuff to do. I really am nervous about being out here, especially I haven't got a building around me. <laughs> How much would have I got? Oh, well, we could just go into this cave down here, make a doorway. Is that a cave? Um, It is a cave. 
Oh, uh, this could be a little good hidey hole, possibly. But I'd rather just have something over above ground. So instead, of, so it'll be easy. I can just walk straight out and feed the cows, for example. And I don't have any freaking wheat on me because I put it all away. There's a spider, there's a skeleton. Heep. Right, what to do now? Hey, uh, let me think. Hmm. Oh yeah, I remember now. Why well, I'm saying I just mentioned cows. I need to breed these buggers up because I need all these bookcases ready for enchanting. So this is probably going to take some time. I, I know it is. I've only got three. I need absolute bazillion of the buggers. That's all I know. Uh, I really did wish I get, got that on camera. Primarily because if we just look around here, what do you see? An ender pearl. Yes. Just in case I was minding my own business and saw two endermans literally right next to me. And... Oh, you little... Stealing my ender pearl. Give it back. Come on, come on back here, you little bugger. I can't believe that. I was about to get the ender pill myself, and this little freaking freak decides to rob it. Right, I'm going to have to be quick with this. Um, right. Give me the dirt a minute. Oh! Phew! <laughs> Oh my god, that was a little bit too close for comfort. Ah. And it is even now with these freaking idiots freaking waiting for me. Tough luck, mate. You're going to have to go hungry. Right, I'm back. And it's been around about, say, two plus hours. I'm not sure exactly how long because obviously logged off in between that sort of time strain. It's not been a content to us. But either way... Um, we've been breeding those bloody cows, and all I can say is, it's taken for bloody ever. Just starting off with those two freaking cows, and just wait to see what we got. Voila, just look at all that. How many freaking cows have we got? I have no idea. And how's the sound level right now? Do, 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 do. Hostile creatures, weather, music, uh... Friendly creatures down to four. Let's dump it down to forty-four percent. Either way, just look at that freaking tons of them. I mean, even if I press F3, and um, what's it say on the entities? Hundred and thirty. Christ Almighty, that's gonna be fun to freaking kill. So, at least on this note, we've got we're gonna have all the level we need for our bookcases. Yes, right. Now the fun test. Slaughter. This is going to be taking a quite a while just to kill all freaking 130 the buggers. No, not quite all 130. I want to try and leave it around about, say, four to six of them. So, it's going to, like I said, it's going to take a while. Be back in a minute. There we go. Oh, God knows how many of them. How much freaking steak did we get? Go away. Go, go, go. You are not escaping. Right, how many did steak did we get? One, two, three. Three and a half stacks of steak. Nice. And leather, we've got about 100. So, that's 100 bucks for us. That is freaking awesome. Right, now we got to head back. So, we can actually try and get these bookcases built. And then we can enchant our very first item. I think we're going to go with like a damn sword or something. I'm just hoping the enchant's not going to be bloody rubbish. Either way, that's good. Either way, that's going to be quite challenging to get the extremely good enchants, and it's probably going to take a while as well. Hey, we got lots, lots and lots of freaking sugar cane. Now, one thing I still wish I had was, um, how can I put it bluntly, eggs, so we can actually make cake. That'd be cool. All right, you know, even though you lie, as you know, cake is a lie. Yeah, I play way, way too much bloody Portal 2, but I'm just hoping we're going to have enough books for this. Right, first things first, throw all that on there, and that go like that. We don't need freaking one like that, and like that. Hopefully this should be enough books, but we'll see. Right, that is 41. Let's just do one last batch of paper. And, right, we just need some more wood, and we need to throw some bloody crap in here. So, bloody, how much freaking steak we've got? Yeah, I mentioned it before, freaking nearly three and a half stacks of the stuff. Not three and a half, is it? That's two stacks. Two and a half stacks. Oh, what? Oh, I don't know. Freaking went to that slot and didn't even really realise. Yeah, three and a half stacks. So, wood goes in there. And let's just dump that and do that. Oh, one. Two. 
No, 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 no. <laughs> Freaking wrong place there. <laughs> and three, and then the books, like so. It's 13. I think that is a start. And let's just dig a little bit of area out. I could put it up on the surface, to be honest, in all honesty. It's like loads of space up there. And plus the fact I hardly think we're going to get freaking attacked by anything. Yeah, let's just place it here. So, and the thing is, once I've placed it down, I can't really move it either. Because I don't have any freaking silt touch. Or any silt touch for that matter. So, one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. Four. Five. And two. One more should have sufficed, but meh. God, I thought that was a freaking mob then, that bloody obsidian portal. Freaking... Made me jump. Right, um, we need this. We need our enchanting table. And then we just need a couple diamonds because we want to make that freaking first enchanted diamond sword. And we want it to be a good one at that. Right, let's just do this quickly. Oh, yeah, we need the lovely lapis as well. Right. Oh, diamond sword. Yay. Hey. Right, just um, throw that and that and that and that in there. We don't exactly need that just yet. Oh yeah, lapis, lapis, lapis. Had I thrown a book on the floor? Um, one, two. No, oh, it should do. We're not exactly going to use it all, but it's a start, right? Come on, please give me a good enchantment. Right, place this down here. Can we get level thirteen chance? What we got? Not back two or oh, breaking. Not back. Two. Hmm. Um, let me just make another book, because I'm sure it's not giving me full levels. Right, this won't take a second. And... Got books, I need f one more bloody book. Right, one. And that. And one. And this, and one, and a two. And a three. This should hopefully give me that full ass bloody 30 levels. Please, 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 please. One, two. Right. Enchant. Still got to give me not, not back two. Why the hell's he gone to 28? He should be level 30. And I keep pressing Q. Uh, right. I'm going to have to make a few more bookcases back in a minute. Right. Hopefully this should work like a bloody charm. Right. Let's try this again. One, two, oh, level 30 enchantment. And I have no idea what this thing is going to be, but three levels gone. So, please be something good. Not back two. Is that it? Oh, it's a start. Not too bad. Let's just, um, let's go for a damage check. Man. This is risky. Uh, what we got? Protect. Oh, yes, please. Protection four. Unbreaking three. Fawns two. That is pretty cool. Um, let's try. Oh no no no! We want the boots. We want the boots. Please be feather falling. Oh my god! That's on camera. That is on freaking camera. Yes. Oh yes yes yes. Right. We've only got thirty-seven levels left, so it's enough for a few more enchantments. Let's just throw that in there. Feather falling. Yes, that's on camera. So on camera. And I freaking... <laughs> I did that wrong. Right, that's on. Need the leggings. Even though it's an old, I know it's a waste, but I'm going to do some damn... Um, no, we want the pickaxe. We want the pickaxe next. Please be something good. Fortune 2. Efficiency 2. Efficiency 1. Mm, let's go with that one. Go full hot. Oh, yes, please. I'll take that. I'll take that very thank you much indeed. Oh, my God. We just... I can't believe... I'm on a freaking roll with these freaking enchantments. Oh, my God. This is absolutely fantastic. Even though I am enchanted my leggings and my helmet, because I'm thinking I might go full diamond. That is freaking excellent. Oh, I'm so happy about this. I'm so freaking happy. Right, I've got... Oh, I don't know what to do next now. <laughs> Oh my god, this is freaking excellent. Either way, we've got a lot done in this episode. That is absolutely fantastic. So looking at my timer, which I'm looking at right now, uh, we have near enough, not near enough, we've ran 
over time, probably about by a few minutes. But either way, I'm not complaining. Just look at that. Freaking Feather Falling and Death Strider. Look at that protection. Unbreaking and Falling down the big one. Un unbreaking, efficiency, and fortune. So pretty, pretty freaking cool. So in the next episode, I'm not too sure exactly what we're going to be doing. Maybe exploring the melon, being very ris very risky because we want to try and get some, how can I put it bluntly, we need some blazer rods so we can actually start on the fun bit of the potions. That is going to be very scary because that could be dangerous for us. In the, or it could be like me, this series could end early, so yeah, I'm very scared. Or we could explore out into the wilderness and try and find some chickens wherever they may be. Because all we need is a few eggs. We could not need to start the episode, but I'm mumbling on now. I'm completely mumbling on. <laughs> yeah, anyways. So if you have enjoyed this episode, I would like to see much more from this series. Please make sure to like, comment, and most importantly, please subscribe. Because every single like, comment, and subscription helps my channel so, so much. And it'll be awesome, absolutely awesome. If you could actually help us reach that magical 200 subscriber mark. And I'll see you next time.